Hi, this is Jack Pollock at the IPG Media Lab, and I'm alongside Case Lynx, CEO of Green Peak Technologies, and here we're talking a little bit about the Zigbee Alliance. Can you tell us about Green Peak and what you're doing here at CES? Uh, Green, Green Peak is about Zigbee, and uh, Zigbee is the new technology for the smart home. And if you're familiar with Wi Fi, uh, Wi Fi distributes content, uh, internet, emails, photos, whatever, through the home. But uh, there are also many other devices that you would like to get on the network, on the internet. And Wi-Fi is a little bit overkill for sensors that sometimes send a little bit of information. So, and therefore the Zigbee standard is uh, very, very well suited. Uh, yeah. So what makes it a little bit different? Is it lower energy? Yeah, what uh, the real trouble is with Wi-Fi, and you probably know that, is you have to recharge the batteries quite regularly. So let's just take an example. You have, say, 50 devices in your house, and the battery life would be a year, and you end up changing one battery every week. And we thought, no, that's not a good idea. Zigbee is about battery life exceeding the life of the product. So you install it, the battery will stay there, and the battery exceeds the life of the product. So you have never to change any batteries. The smart home becomes maintenance free, and that's something Wi-Fi won't do, but Zigbee can. Absolutely. Now I know we're kind of about uh, creating standards here, but what are some devices? You know, we talk a lot about the smart home. What are what are some use cases that you see being the kind of the catalyst for driving, you know, people to actually have some of these devices? Is it security? Is it do you see it in kind of appliances? Can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah. Well, we see a lot of demand in security systems. Uh, uh, security systems are sensors, motion sensors. Uh, basically, motion sensors can now be connected to a set of box or a gateway. And by connecting those set of box and a gateway, you have the motion sensors connected to the internet. So if something happens, you can get a text message or you can get the whole neighborhood a text message that something is happening in your house, which uh, should not be the case. And that's just an example of a use case where networking makes a lot of sense. Now, security, energy management, you know, thermostats, uh, windows open and close. You know, if somebody opens the window, you know, you better turn off the air conditioning. Otherwise, you're kind of uh, uh, air conditioning for the birds, right? Yeah. That's uh, not the goal. Uh, and that are kind of more examples of, you know, why the smart home is pretty smart. Huh? Terrific. Thank you so much. For more news like this, check back at IPGLab.com.